shooting. Today we are going to start chapter number six, cyber safety. In this video, I am going to discuss about malware, types of malware, hacking, the mode of hacking, phishing, password cracking, spoofing. First thing, whenever we used to use a network, get connected with the internet, or whenever we used to use any of the device, the first thing which come in our mind is whether we got a virus attack or not. Is this a virus? Oh my god, this virus is going to disturb my mobile phone. Such kind of words people used to say and then get threatened with these such names. We are going to discuss about malware. Malware. They are just mysterious set of instructions. Let me remove the word mysterious. They are the set of instructions. Set of instruction is known as program. They are mysterious set of instructions. Mysterious means they were designed to perform a task. But they are not performing the same task. They are working in another manner. Means these are the softwares which are designed to perform a particular task, but they are not performing the task for what they are designed for. They are just giving a random job, just like a student, a bad student. Whenever a teacher is going to instruct him at an exam, do this thing, this thing. What do you do? You get absent. You get absent. That is what malware. Malware comprises of virus, swarms, trojans, spyware, ransom, and attack. Most of the world you have heard about. Virus, bombs hold the property. They both hold the property of self-replication. So what is the self-replication? Virus and bomb, these two software, use the property of self-replication means if we have one in number, it will get replicated itself and it will take two, four, six, eight, sixteen, thirty-two, and so on. The basic problem what they used to do is while during the process of replication, they used to block our RAM memory. They used to keep uh, take all the stuff or all the space from our RAM memory, which made working of our device slow. Wires and bonds are the program which used to do, which use the property of self-replication, they disturb the normal functioning of a long computer system. Talking about bombs, the bombs hold one more property that is easy crawling property. Easy crawling property. The virus does not, a virus intentionally transmit from one computer to another. Virus never transmit from one computer to another computer without knowing known of user. If a virus is transmitted from source A to B, it means either B is knowing about or either A is knowing about means someone is there who is knowing about that virus has been transmitted. But in case of worms, it is not there. It can crawl means a person if you use uh, inserting a pen drive inside a system of A and A have bomb virus, have bomb marker there. So it can easily crawl to pen drive and easily crawl to B system. Means easy crawl. No easy crawl. Talking about Trojan also. Trojan host is a virus which has been designed to do a proper task. Means sometimes if we visit a play store or somewhere to be used to download some software that it is written that this software is going to perform this task, this task, this task. But the moment when we install, it never performs a task like that. Such type of software is known as Trojan host software. Okay, Trojan host software are designed to perform a task, but the moment when we install that software, it never did correspond like that. Spyware. Spyware is a software which is intentionally transmitted from user from user to the device. It means intentionally transmitted to steal the data, even ID, password, or some privacy details. Spyware is a type of software which has been installed intentionally with the help of images, video, PC with the case of PCV intentionally it is installed in the computer system to hide privacy data. Ransomware, it's, it's a type of vi a virus which block normal functioning of computer system and in response it give a message to format computer system or pay for the data. Means ransomware is a type of virus which attack computer system and steal the data 
Now, for returning the data, it asks for certain amount of money. Otherwise, it will ask to format your device. And then these are the software which give multiple ads in a mobile phone, multiple ads in the system, so that the people, uh, the user get irritated. Again, I am repeating by this whole property of self-replication to block the normal functioning of computer system. There are multiple type of wires, we will discuss about them. Worms, worms have easy cloud facility. It also replicates itself, project calls of the software which are designed by saying that they will perform a task, but in spite of that, they perform a different task. Spire is a type of software which used to steal user data, which used to steal user data, user privacy data. Ransomware is a type of software which is installed in the computer system to get a privacy or a uh, sorry, ransomware is a type of software which is installed in the computer system. It can steal the data and can, will ask for payment. If a user pay, he will get the data back. Otherwise, all the data will be formatted or cleared from the manufacturer of this virus. Admin is a type of virus. Uh, Admin is a type of virus which gives multiple ads. We are just talking about hacking. Hacking is a technique in which user access illegally user access to the computer system to get certain amount of privacy data. Hacking is a technique in which user illegal तरीके से किसी device को उसका है और उसके data को hack कर रहा है. Phishing. Phishing came from the word phishing where people use to wait for a fish. They used to put a trap and wait for a fish to get a fish catch into that trap. The same technique is followed in this phishing where some hackers used to set a trap with multiple modes that you want this lottery or they will get a drone page. So with the help of that technique they used to set a trap and the user get connected with this in this trap and they lose the data. Password tracking, this is basically done from the known sources. They will just try multiple passwords and somehow they will get connected to the password. It means if I'm using 12357, so the user will keep trying the password or with the help of Linux operating system, they will keep trying the password tracking mode and somehow they will get the data password tracking. And you have seen in Hollywood movies, they used to insert a card, some number of flashes, and then you get the password. Spoofing, it's a technique where we used to get a spam calls or message demanding for uh, offering you some lotteries or some win, uh, victories in spite of getting your rewards they will ask you to pay certain amount of small, uh, a small amount of money these type of things with the help of IP and email spoofing the people used to do means if you are getting such kind of things say that what we have to do we have to we have certain amount of tools in our computer system just activate them first one is Antivirus. Antivirus is also known as virus, but it is designed to block a normal functioning of these all. They are properly designed to stop the normal function, to stop the functioning of these all. Take antivirus. After that, you can also use uh, different kind. Defender, firewall, defender, firewall. These both, these both are the technique which block, which block the illegal access or unmodified access or a spam access to your computer system to your device. Just like we used to call it to block a spam calls, a spam messages. Same like a defender and firewall used to work. <coughs> Moving more further, the in your book page number 118 it is given what is boot sector virus boot sector virus will uh, restarting whenever you have switched on or restart your phone it used to write reboot it used to write reboot reboot is a process in which we restart the computer booting means starting your computer a virus which deletes your startup file is known as boot sector virus. 
electric. Uh, we have discussed about maintenance facility, cookies. By what we have discussed, problem messages we have discussed, antivirus we have discussed. Now, I have also seen many Thank you.